So Catholics do read the Bible. A lot of people say they don't read the Bible. My mom has gotten me this over almost three decades. So this is awesome. They also have the Magnificent, but it's called the Word Among Us. And so as Catholics, people would say, do Catholics read the Bible? Yes, they do. They just don't maybe realize they do. So today is the 6th. And so there's prayers just for your morning. And so if you ever did the Liturgy of the Hours, which our priests do and our deacons do, this is a lot that's called Liturgy of the Hours, Lectio Divina. So anyway, your first reading is always, uh, wait, oh, this one's different because, okay, hold on. <laughs> okay, let's pretend it's a second. <laughs> We're teaching everybody. Oh, it's usually Old Testament, but for some reason these are, uh, okay, hold on. It's because it's Christmas season. All right, let's just give you a date of the 15th. We're just going to pretend. Okay, so usually the first reading is Old Testament, always. So that's the Old Testament, teaching them. Then Psalm is always your song. And Psalm, everybody knows what that is. There's 150 Psalms. That's how the rosary was created. So when everyone's like, what's the rosary? That's exactly God was just having everyone praise the Lord. And then your gospel is always Matthew, Mark, Luke, or John. Always, 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 always gospel. So it's there's three cycles, an A and a B and a C. So if you went to daily mass every day and on Sunday, you would read the whole Bible in three years. So that way it just kind of helps. So anyone else, just God bless you and have a great day.